What's up everybody, it's Landon and we're back with more of the Scholar of the First Sin. And uh, we're picking up right where we left off last time. We're actually going to talk to you. Yeah, 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 yada, 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 yada. Uh, just keep talking to her. Okay. Exhaust her dialogue until she says it's high time that she um, gets out of here. When you exhaust her dialogue, at a certain point in this area, she will go to Majula and actually serve you there further. So, that's the best thing you can do. Quickly, we're going to run up these steps and beat down, beat some, beat some door booty. There we go. I try to kill this thing. Oh, got it. Yes. Tight night shard. These are basically the equivalents of, um, how do I put this? Little creepy crawly dudes in Bloodborne that you kill. They give you uh, bloodstone shards. They're basically the equivalent of that. You get a soldier helm, just some armor. I'm not going to be using any armor. I'm not being a strength build or anything. Pure magic, so that would be good. Double tap X if you want to open the door faster. Spam this guy a few times. Dead? Not gonna drop anything? Fine. Come over here and open this chest. I'm a little sick, so I do apologize for the sniffles and all that good jazz. Small white sign soapstone and two radiant life gems. The white sign soapstone, if I can remember which button to click. Uh, let's see here. Should be, yep. Yeah. No, that's not it. What am I doing? What am I doing? Hold on. I know we just picked that up. Where is it at? Oh, here we go. Gosh. This allows you to leave summon signs um, to uh, help other people in their world if you want to. There's a summon sign right there. Very carefully drop down and get this divine blessing. Fall down a little bit further. And you can touch the summon signs. And um, you can basically tell who's a player and who's uh, NPC in this game. There's tons of NPCs that help you. But um, this one's obviously a player, judging by the name. And uh, that completes that section. So I'm going to head out here. Cut you down to size, and actually, before I go further, I'm just going to give a quick rest here. Alright. Of course, we're going to have to kill this guy again, but that's fine. Take him down, then we're going to head to this area. Simply drop down. And this can be a little tricky at an early level. That's the reason. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I'm in a bad way. Uh-oh. Nope. Alright. Don't do that. Don't do what I did. Try to spam them with spells. <laughs> Use another life gem here. Alright. Gonna keep going this way that we backed up into. Don't fall down there. Not yet. Um, this is actually where we came from earlier. We went around, climbed the ladder, and got up there. This is just a little opening here. Here. Do a fancy little run and jump. Cross that gap and get a human effigy. Those are very scarce, honestly, in the early parts of the game. Take this guy out while I'm talking. Um, so, 
be cautious early on. Later on, they're not that big of a deal. But uh, early on, just be aware of what you're using, pretty much. And uh, from here, we should be able to yeah. Tap R3. And you'll be able to lock on to various enemies down here and get the drop on them. Oh, there you are. You almost knocked me off, little butt. I don't know if that would actually hit him or not. Because of the tree branch there. Oh. Kill you. Backing up, backing up, backing up, backing up. Now there's time to be. Right, you're dead. Grab the soul of the lost undead and a torch. I don't know if I said this before, but the torches you gather actually um, add up on each other. So um, it just increases the time that you have the torch. So you don't have to like worry about how many torches you have and all that. It just adds up. He's looking a little sketchy right now. Um, Alright. Now. Turtle Man! These guys are pretty brutal. Very heavy attacks. Try to back up and just keep hammering him with spells. There's another one here that I actually used to miss all the time. It's very easy to miss. He is just standing in a very dark hole. Back up. Give him a few more. Might be able to... Yes! Alright. We're completely out of soul arrows, but that's not... It's not gonna hurt us at this point. Because I think most of the enemies... That we really need them for are dead run up here and take care of you. Just keep whacking at him. Did you drop anything? No. No, you don't like me. Go over here and grab some life gems. Three of them, in fact. And then, we're going to very carefully try and get a awesome weapon, at least for us, starting off. So, make a mad dash like the maddest dash you could possibly make and open the store immediately as you can see opening doors makes you invisible in this game it's pretty awesome it's kind of like bloodborne in that aspect now we've got the fire long sword which does fire damage and it's obviously better than this dagger is going to be oh crud so proud knight oh we might be dead we might be doomed Ah, uh, we made it quickly run out and grab that soul. Now I'm going to make easy work of this area by climbing this ladder. You do lose stamina holding down circle in this game while climbing ladders, just know that. I'm going to attempt to run back to the bonfire from here. Probably the worst idea ever. Dodge that. Oh my goodness. Yep, worst idea ever. Hold on. Good grief. Alright, hold on. I'm not okay with this. I have some beef. There's one dead. One butthole dead. Lock on to him. What are you doing, game? He's right in front of you. Thank you. Jeez. Kept locking on to the guy behind him. I'm gonna kill you now, because you're really annoying. And now I'm gonna climb the ladder. Oh, and grab this item that I didn't get off of this dude. It's probably an infantry helm. Oh, a sword. Sweet. And pop squat. Oh, hi, dude. Check. Someone. 
All right, and that's going to be it for this section of the game and the end of this episode. If you liked it, please like, <laughs> and comment, subscribe, and thank you guys for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. See if we can do this. Where's my wave? There it is. Adios.